Good day, everyone, and welcome to Bailey's Do Disney Orlando vlog series day two. Day two, yeah, yeah. Day one was yesterday. We're only on day two, and I'm already messing it up. Day two, where we've got Animal Kingdom today. <laughs> Might see Chip and Dale. Hopefully, we see Chip and Dale. We do. Sorry, I'm just getting last bits. Today. Yeah, we're literally we're getting everything sorted now. We're going to Boma for breakfast. Then we're going to Animal Kingdom, and then tonight we're going to Sanaa. Sanaa, which we love as well. These two oh, are always going to be on our itinerary because we love them so much but yeah we're gonna go for um breakfast now and we'll show you when we get there because boma is incredible and we cannot wait morning everyone that is us we've just driven over to animal kingdom lodge for boma you've got your blanket you're all chipping dowed up today aren't you yeah i'm using um you cold yeah it's yeah. a bit chilly I, mean, I i like it this is nice and fresh from pop uh, to boma i mean if you're in that disney bubble anyway everything's close but it took us 10 minutes it was so close um it's really close, isn't it? Bearing in mind, yes. we're comparing our last trip, last May, we stayed um, in a villa in Davenport. The villa was amazing. Oh, Miller was lovely. Miller? Miller was lovely. <laughs> villa was lovely. Miller, we never ate at Miller's. So, um, That's can't. On this trip, though. Are we eating at Miller's I'm this time? To, yeah. I just turn up. I just turn up, eat what I'm told to eat, <laughs> dress what I'm told to dress in, and just uh, have fun. That's, that's good. Um, I just do pin trading. I just turn up and do pin trading. I actually said that to Sarah. So, Sarah Pat said, Pat my pins. Um, priorities don't worry about the passport as long as we've got the pins that's all that matters um yeah so we're going for boma now but yeah i love being back in the, the disney bubble um yeah, we stayed in nice. yeah it is isn't it sorry yeah, everything's really close isn't it so it yeah. is nice but yeah oh, i don't know i do like the miller but... <laughs> jesus christ <laughs> callum's falling down the stairs mate hold on to the banister why, why he's having we, a mess i don't know why are we vlogging why we need to cancel this to like anyway here's animal kingdom <laughs> Six good guesses. Look you. Oh, we've got that Mr. one. That's Ruby. the white rabbit. Yeah. We've got those two, haven't we? Yeah. Um, we go to Twenty-three. Thank you. What is it, Callum? It's like a. Thank you. So we've checked in, and our um our reservation uh, for Boma has just flashed up saying ready. So we're going to go there now. Just a quick one on the on the pin trading. It is hit and miss whether you get uh, good pins or not, especially at these trading counters. Sometimes you get some great ones, other times, most of the time, they're not that great. But yeah, today was not so great. But we'll see, we'll keep pin trading. We've got about another two, well, just short of two weeks of pin trading, so we'll, we'll definitely find some more. Um, but yeah, there's, there's a lot of terrible ones, but occasionally you do get good ones. And occasionally the, the, um, the cast members will have some in their pocket as well for, for really good kids and really good people. Thank you. Thank You're you. Welcome. Good morning. Morning. Good 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 morning. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Uh, the restaurants here, Boma, they do it in um, Chef Mick as well. They've got this pog juice here, which is like a specialty in Disney, and it's amazing. And obviously, I get a, a jug of coffee as well. I'm the only one that drinks coffee. But I just said to the gentleman there, these things called zebra domes, they're like, I don't know what they are, but they're, they're like a dessert, chocolate mousse. They're, they're a specialty to Animal Kingdom. However, I've never tried them. And, and on the 2014 trip, 2016, I said, I need to try them, I need to try them. We never tried them. Last year we said we need to do it. We didn't do it again. I just said to the man there, do you sell them here or do you have them here? And he said, only in the evening we've got them. Uh, but you can actually buy them from next door. Anyway, he's just come over to me and said, look, don't tell anyone, but I've snuck. Don't, he said, don't tell anyone, I've snuck you off in the back. So I've just told everyone. But no, Jenny, he's just and got me one from the back and said, I've got you one, so I'm gonna have to share it with um with Sarah, Cam and Paige. If you've eaten them before, tell us, comment down below whether you like them or not, because I haven't tried it yet, but I'd be interested to know what people think. Because reading online, a lot of people say they're good, but there are a few people saying not not a fan. But yeah, tell us what your thoughts if you tried them. And if you haven't tried them, is it saying what is on your list in Disney or Orlando that Gideon's cookie has to be on your list. If you never had a Gideon's cookie, get that on your list. But what's on your list that you want to try when you come to Orlando? 
because they've got their, their food. How cool is that? Look, they've got waffles, I, bacon. They have symbol waffles. Oh, a symbol waffles. Well. And then what they do, they do this ham here. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's like a chunk a chunk of ham. And apparently the man sliced pages boxes up for her. That was nice of him, wasn't it? Ah, oh, how lovely. Can I try? Mm, days, that's really good. Yeah. Try this page. Specialty to Animal Kingdom. It's actually really good. Do you want to try the last bit, sir? It's good, isn't it? Really good. We'll have to buy some of them before we leave. Boma. Thoughts? Amazing. 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 I give it a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10? Yeah. I think I have to agree. If we're giving Chef Mickey's a 9.5, Boma's got to be 10, surely. The waiter gives us, um, what is it called again? A zebra dome. A zebra dome. Yeah. Yeah, I he was it. amazing. He kept us topped up, gave us a zebra dome. What, um, the guy that he taught you called Boo? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, his name was Bo. I didn't know that. And uh, when we left, so. It's your fault, you made me panic. So I was like, we need to say bye, we need to say bye. He was busy, so he was speaking. So he wasn't even close to me. He was about, I don't know, 10, 15 meters away. And he was speaking and I was like- Shouting, bye boo. <laughs> I didn't know. I was like, I didn't want him to think we were just leaving me a room. So I was like, bye boo, bye boo. And I walked away and so I looked to me. I said, it's a weird name, isn't it, boo? And he was like, she's like, what? And I said, boo. And she was like, his name was Bo. <laughs> that's a weird name as well, isn't it? I've never heard of that. Not weird, that's not, that's not a right thing to say, but unusual. That's an unusual name. So anyway, Boo, Bo, I'm sorry, Bo. Um, yeah. Anyway, the food, oh, that fish. genuinely, a, a 10 out of 10, maybe a bit, I don't know, there's nothing wrong with that. I know, we can't give it a nine out of 10. That is, but that is hands down, no arguing, that is the best buffet breakfast in the whole of Disney. Mike, we've parked a giraffe, 228. So we don't, it was actually here that we lost the car, wasn't it? For the, for the first time. For the, Taking a draft. Yeah, we lost the car. That was 2016. That was, that was. Yeah, it wasn't good. Um, just for reference, uh, we we didn't pay parking today because we're staying on um, site. Pop Century. They only bought that back recently, so you used to have to pay even if you stayed at Disney. So years ago, you used to get included, and then they actually they didn't used to charge to park here, but they used to charge to park at the hotels at Disney. Now you don't pay for parking at hotels, and you don't pay for parking here. So that's a nice little perk staying on site. But when we check out in a few days time, like four days, um, when we go to a off-site hotel, then we'll have to pay $30 a day for parking. So it is what it is, but just uh, make sure you factor that into your expenses. Expenses, you're spending money. Send help. I'm 
There's Daisy on the left. Someone's happy, excited. So the lady just said, oh, you're there too. And she said, I just care about Chippendale. <laughs> She's not lying, She's not lying. This is a little trail. If you go to Dino Land and then follow the trail, it takes you right to Chippendale. 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 The, uh, the shape of the board though, how cool is that? Oh, that's, it's so little, it's like ch Chippendale I'm wearing. For those that don't know, I suffer quite um, badly with motion sickness, I said in yesterday's vlog. However, I've got these on, on both hands, which hit the pressure points, whether they work or I'm not sure. And then we've got these on Amazon. They're little patches that go behind your ear, ears, 100% natural herbs, anti-nausea fast, non-drowsy, and apparently they last 72 hours. That being said, they were on my ears until I got in the shower. So unless you're not having a shower in 72 hours, I don't think, or you're not getting that part of the neck wet, they're not going to last um, 72 hours. I went on Tron yesterday, didn't get motion sickness, but we're going on um, Flight of Passage today. So I'm going to put them on again, What's and Sarah's really as well. Uh, Flight of Passage is one where you, you know, you ride the, is it the Banshee? You fly yes, it? Yes, I love that one. Yeah. You remember last time when I was really scared to ride it? Now I love it. Yeah. So when they did the floating mountains, the mountains are floating obviously, but the way they connected the mountains, you see these reeds here, the reeds, these vines here, they're actually beams, so they're like steel columns that have been, yeah, they hold it all together, which is really clever. Um, but yeah, there's, there's so much about this place. That's just so immersive and incredible. The little sea creatures in there. Oh, him down there. Oh my days, Pandora's beautiful. It always will have you in just in complete awe. Oh, that smells good. As you come out, honestly, the, uh, that's, the smells on that were so good the today. The smells have got a, a better than last year. 100%, I was just about to say that, the so scent. I don't know what happened, why the I don't smells know. went as strong last year, but last year in May, they just weren't. On the vlogs, we said you just can't smell, like everyone talks about down Main Street, the, the, the Pandora like, ride. Like it was last time. Um, Pandora ride, the Flight of Passage scent. Um, Pirates of the Caribbean, there's all these scents that you know about but you just couldn't smell them but this time around they've all been so much stronger um, it really smelled amazing that ride however my motion sickness got a bit got the better of me about I don't know I'd say 70% I've got through and then I had to close my eyes because it was just yeah I felt a bit sick but it was, it's a great ride though it's one of the better ones isn't it yeah um, what did you think Hannah? good great ride isn't it yeah oh good sorry not great teenager level you can't be can't be too positive <laughs> You having a good day, guys? Yeah, you live in Disney World, we don't. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, look at Lucky. Us. Look at us. Look at us. How beautiful that little house is. How cool is he? <laughs> 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 oh, we're Kevin, though. Wait, we're Kevin. Oh, oh, Kevin. 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 Nemo. Finding Nemo at Animal Kingdom, we've never seen it before. Yeah. It's very blue, don't we? That's because the stage is very blue. Um, but yeah, we've never seen it before. We've done the Festival of the Lion King loads of times, we love that, but we've never seen this one, so we're really excited, aren't we? Uh huh, and also we get the bubble area. Yeah, we're in and the bubble area. Somebody has said, um, Oh, I want to be in the bubble area. No, I hate bubbles. Yeah, that's what the mum said. No way, I hate bubbles. So they didn't sit in the bubble area. 
Should we move? No! That's us out of the Finding Nemo. What do we think, guys? It was good. My good. favourite bit was the bubbles. Out of all the acting, your favourite bit was the bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was good. Um, what are we saying? That versus uh, Lion King. What are we saying? Oh, Lion, Lion King. King. Yeah, yeah, I think so as well. Lion King was a lot better, in my opinion. They're both good. We've but got that in a bit. Yeah, Lion we have King got was that. Way better. Lion King, we're going to watch that in a minute. <gasps> guys, our question to you, and it's a bit of a leading question now because we've given our opinion, but what do you prefer? Both. They're both good, both really definitely worth watching both. Very tough. A tip I have given before, but I'll give it to you again, um, just for those that may not have seen it, is if you do want to pin trade, you want to come to Disney World, Disneyland, Disney Cruises and pin trade. Bearing in mind, we came last May and I didn't have, I think I might have had one or two pins that were a gift, but I didn't really care much for them. Um, so you might come and then go, oh, I really, I really like it. And the cheapest pins you'll probably find in Disney World, genuinely, is you might get a pack of four or six for thirty dollars say they're not cheap you might get 20 yeah between 20 and 30 dollars they're not cheap um and then you pay you buy them but you don't really want to trade them because you just bought bought them from a shop and they're quite nice biggest tip i can give is go on to amazon or ebay probably ebay and you can buy a pack for about 10 20 pounds it's really cheap and then once you've got those those pins you then you can bring them to disney world disney cruise disneyland and then trade them for pins you like. So then you start getting collectibles. Like the ones I'm wearing now, these are all my favorites. So I've got the Queen's Jubilee, I've got the King's Coronation, I've got the Mad Hat, I've got Tigger. Um, I've got the ones I like basically. Whereas the ones I've got in my pocket right here, are all the ones I've put them on a lanyard that you can keep in a bag, but I put them in there and they're the ones I'm happy to trade. So if I see any, or the kids see any, when we're walking past um, any pin trading stands, we just yeah use the cheap ones um, so that's a, a huge tip and it will save you a lot of money so the walk between pandora to africa is beautiful this is it here and it's really quiet oddly there's two ways of doing it i think this is the more quiet route so if you can do it this way definitely try um but yeah we're on our way to uh africa now to go and watch festival of the lion king let's do it thank you i present to you his majesty I am King. Welcome, everyone. Hi, everybody. Hey, Boomer, come on. Look, everyone, it's the Lion King. What do you think, sir? Oh, I love it. I love it all. What do you think, Al? Good. It is incredible. The, and then when you leave as well, the show continues. because That's the stampede bit when you when you leave. Um, it, yeah, such a good show. That is so good. And, and like I say, we've seen that. What is that our fifth time we've seen that? Yeah, it just gets better. It, just it, it, it does get better because the it monkeys were back. The yeah, the tumbling monkeys were back. They weren't there last year for some reason. I don't. I don't want to start getting into COVID, but it was COVID. I believe that said they weren't allowed to come back. I don't know why. If you know why they weren't there, then comment down below because that would actually interest me. Because the show returned, but there was just no monkeys. Um, the show the was. Tumbling the tumbling monkeys are so good. So good. So, yeah, we love that. We're going to go and grab something to eat now, some snack, or hey. we don't really know, but yeah, we're going to go grab something to eat. And then, uh, and then yeah. What's that? The, the, the monkey guy, the tumbling monkey captain going up to Callum Gabe. <laughs> and Callum was like, why always me? Why me? <laughs> Thank you. That looks good. And that is, it's right here, the tropical shaved ice. It was okay, it's not too bad. I'd probably give it a six out of 10. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't get it again. That's for sure. It's refreshing though. It's refreshing and it does taste okay. But Sarah just said, just tastes a bit like Pog juice, but an ice version. So, which I had about 10 glasses of this morning at breakfast, but it is good. And it, like I say, it's refreshing. On a hot day, I'd, I'd recommend, but they did have other flavors and I didn't see that before, but pina colada flavor is probably the one I would have gone for if I'd have read the sign. 
Eight Spoon Cafe, which yes. is not far from Flame Tree. I asked and she said it's exactly the same one. It's no different except the portion size. It doesn't come with onion rings. It doesn't come with coleslaw. Let's know what you think. That's good. Is it? That was only five bucks as well. I mean, it's not a massive portion, but it's probably good for a little snack, I'd say. A little snacky snack. Chevron, what you just bought? <gasps> Brand new Chippendale. They have gone to the best home ever. Amazing. How cool are they? Do you love them? More Chippendale to add to the collection. And it's never going to stop growing. Can I have a question? Oh, here's a question. Yeah, yeah. I have a question. So when you line up for 20 minutes to get a photo in front of the Tree of Life, do you expect the Tree of Life to actually be in the photo? They're all just very focused, like close up, so you didn't lovely really photos. see. Don't lovely get me wrong, lovely. You just didn't see the tree though. But it's like, tree. Yeah. It's like that's um, what we actually keep yeah. up for. Or yeah. am, I, am I just being ungrateful? Yeah. No, you know, I know what you mean. <laughs> yeah, we like a picture of the tree, so yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, it is. Same. So yeah, the night blossom from Pandora with um, the boba balls or whatever they're called. Ask for extra boba balls. Yeah, top tip, ask for extra boba balls. Yeah, definitely. It looks amazing. We know it tastes amazing. Put it to the brim as well. They really haven't skimmed from that. Tastes like a twister. That's what it did. Does it still have that? That's good. That's good. Depression. Don't get the frozen ice like I did, the shaved ice, because that was not good. <laughs> so I had the shaved ice. It wasn't shaved, it was just a ball of ice in the end, and then uh, loads of syrup. So I feel like, oh, I don't feel good after drinking a whole cup of syrup. They're really cute, they're little avatar babies. They're cute, aren't they? Oh, look at this avatar spirit jersey. That's awesome. I like that. No, look at that. Look at that. What a tail. An avatar tail, an avatar lounge fly bag. Oh, that's cool. Not sure. Oh, look at Chippendale. You can buy the flight of passage smell. You know, when you're on the ride and it's a really strong smell. Yeah, it really is. It's that, that's mad. You can actually buy it as a candle. So I know there are other companies that sell it um, back in the UK. $20 though isn't bad. I mean, yeah, you could definitely get half the price if you waited in the UK, but it's quite big. So, in Africa, as you come in, just where the, uh, the dance is going on here, you get free water. Fill me up, Scotty. Yeah, that'll do me, thank you. Free ice water. Here you go, sir. You have that one. Ah, oh, thanks. Yeah, it's a good little find, isn't it? There she is in the background. We're, well, we'll say we're about to go on that. Mummy and Cam are about to go on that. Um, me and Paige are going to opt out of this one. Oh, look at that. That's quite cool. It's the height of each mountain. I think. Let's have a look. Mount Everest. That's cool. Paige. Mount Everest isn't the tallest mountain. Mount Everest isn't the tallest mountain. Did you know there's a mountain? Tell them. Um, three times bigger in space. In space, there is. And Google it because I said to Paige, no way, that's not true. And it is. There is a mountain three times bigger than Mount Everest in space. Yeti Museum. It's a pretty cool, all the lines in fact, in um, in Disney are really cool. They're, they're so immersive. It's not like you're just queuing for a 40 minute ride and there's not much to show. There's there's loads to show. The theming's amazing and it really keeps the kids and everyone else occupied, so it's cool. This is very similar to the one Paige has got. We called it Everest. It's very similar, isn't it? Yeah. It's very cute. Oh wow, that's super, oh wow, that is super soft. You love a good blanket, don't you? That is weighty. That is the Dino Dig ice cream sandwich. I'll tell you what it is now. It's vanilla ice cream sandwich between two house-made sugar cookies with chocolate sprinkles, cookie crumbs, sugar bones, and a white chocolate dinosaur. How amazing is that? How amazing. What's the verdict? Do you eat it? I wanna know what the verdict is. Good, isn't it? Really nice. <laughs> Brain freeze. So the verdict on the um, on the cake. What are we saying, guys? I'm giving that a six, six. point five. Yeah, six six point five out of ten. What do you think? Yeah. yeah, it's nice. It's not. It's not a bad snack. I don't There's know. A lot of it. There is a lot of it, and it was I think eight dollars or something. Um, yeah. It is good, and actually, I'm glad we got one because I wanted to try it. Uh, but 6.5, yeah, 
not the best thing we've had, but certainly not the worst. There's the crocodile. We see him every year we're here and he, it just blows my mind every single time, just the size of him. Time for Triceratops. Triceratops spin. This spirit jersey here, I don't know if it's new. Disney Pride, that is pretty awesome. That is a very colourful and amazing spirit jersey. I love that. That is awesome. This is the one I was looking at, but it's just a bit too plain for me. I don't know, it's nice, but just a bit too subtle. I want something, but I don't know what. Um, yeah. This is cool. Like, uh, like Finding Nemo, if you're a huge Finding Nemo fan, that, that's awesome. Um, I'm yet to see one that I, I just know, well, basically, know I need to have. That's no glitter! <laughs> just walking past someone getting their face painted. We normally get our face painted when we come to Animal Kingdom, but we, we haven't today. We're just walking past and they're doing the face painting, and then the woman says, Do you want glitter? And the mum shouts, No glitter! <laughs> no glitter! No! Stand by, we're going on Kilimanjaro. We're here at Safari right now. You can tell. Yeah. We're in the lightning line, but it's still a bit long. And guys, we're almost there. Really? We're moving, so we got delayed. We got delayed at Kilimanjaro Safari, but we're moving now. And Sarah wanted to leave the queue. No, I didn't. But you I was like, nah, that's it, we're going. She was like, give it five more minutes. Anyway. Top tip, it's not Mike's random tangent of the day, but it is a top tip, is leave the safari till six in the evening if you can. We've never done it at that time, but oh my God, it was amazing. It was amazing. There were, there were so many animals out. The lion, the lions were out as well. And um, the cheetahs. Cheetahs, yeah. So um, we always get told to go in the morning because that's apparently the best time. We never see anything. Well, we, we, we have- Yeah, we have seen- Seen things, but not, today was the best. 6 p.m. if you can book it, do it. 100%. That's when it closes, it closes at 6, so it's yeah. literally just before it closes. Yeah, yeah, highly recommend doing it at 6 p.m. He's exploring. I think he's going to go at those trees in a second. Go on, where are we going on? Um, Navi Navi River, me and Daddy and Callum and Mummy. I'm going on it. Are you excited? Yeah. Also, can I see the chicken tail? <laughs> I need new legs, sir. <laughs> Send me new legs in the pole. This is now at Animal Kingdom Lodge where we're going to go for some uh, food. We're going to go for some food at Sanaz, aren't we? You excited for food, guys? Yes. yes. We love the bread service at Sanaa, by the way. That is incredible. You'll see it in a minute. But um, yeah, the bread service is incredible. And then the food in Sanaa is just amazing. It's one of our favorite places to eat. Go the wrong way. We went the wrong way for about, I don't know, it must be about 100 meters until we realized we went the wrong way. So you have to come up to level two, you have to, to walk down the corridor, to go to the um, yes. elevators and it takes you down to level one again, which is very odd, but it is what it is. Welcome back, and what's your favorite item on the menu? The bread uh, service. Yeah. The bread service has arrived. How amazing. Um, normally they come over and tell you what each one is, and it's, it's quite a performance, but tonight 
they just they just dumped on the table, mumbled something under the face mask, and uh, walked off. But it looks good nonetheless. So that's the bread service done. Um, that was amazing as ever, wasn't it? Uh, so we've decided. I said nine out of ten. Sarah's saying it's a ten out of ten. We should meet in the middle and say nine point five out of ten. Um, but either way, it's really good. So hopefully the mains will be just as good. They should be on their way shortly. Oh yeah, our cutlery was dirty as well. So she's taken them away and she's got new ones. So I'm not gonna. Paige's like auto. Tell them the cutlery was dirty. <laughs> So the food's here. Cam, what did you get, mate? Butter chicken and mac and cheese. Butter chicken, mac and cheese. Paige got the cheeseburger, cheeseburger mac and cheese. And then myself and Sarah are going to share the rice, butter chicken, and then lentils. And then we've kept our um, sauces from our bread service as well. So yeah, looks good. This is so cool. This is the kids' dessert, which is like, I can't remember what it was called. Was it like a... Pumba's... Dessert grub or something. Pumba's dessert grub. You've got like rocks. They actually look like rocks as well. Bite into it. See if you can. It's chocolate. Our eyes. Yeah. They look awesome. I don't know if the camera picks up very well, but they actually look like rocks. Um, yeah. That looks really cool. How is it, Paige? That looks amazing. Good? You thought they were actual rocks? You thought they were actual rocks? Yeah, they... they <laughs> Like they picked them up, cleaned them, and then put them up. You don't believe, you tell me you're joking. No. <laughs> <laughs> that concludes our day two of Baby to Disney Orlando. Sorry, I'm absolutely knackered tonight. It's a uh, different yeah. what? time. Yeah. A different kind of time. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, she's right. We were suffering a bit from jet lag. Um, oh, exhausted. I think it's about half nine now. Um, yeah. And I went the whole day about being carried. You went the whole day about being carried. I normally carry that a little bit, don't I? That is a huge achievement for Paige Boss. Well done. My little tiny legs are killing now. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> um, what, what's your highlight of the day being Paige? Wait, Mummy, you go first. Can you even see Mummy in this video? I don't know if you can. Don't, uh, I'm, I'm here, it's fine. She's laying down the bed. What's your highlight of the day being Mummy? Um, Actually. No, mate, we're not doing this. She's trying to. We, that's a previous vlog series where she let Sarah go and then jumped, but it is. It was when we went and met the Grinch. Okay, I got trying to say. Go on. Sit. Um. Paige, you go first. Go. My first one is spend time with my family, and the second one is me and Chippendale. now. My family always has to come first. Oh, we love Are you, you Paige. Well, you're my family. No, oh, we love you, Paige. That's spending time with the family is number one. Um, and then meeting Chip and Dale. you said that. <laughs> but you haven't <laughs> said it yet. So my um, highlight of the day is me spending time with my family. So, um, Callum? Breakfast at Boma. Boma was good, wasn't it? Boma was good. And Sarah, what's your highlight of the day? Um, the Lion King. That's Lion King. Amazing. Festival of Lion King. Yeah, that's a fair shout. And myself, I think it was, yeah, it'd be Paige meeting Chip and Dale. I think that was quite, quite nice. Um, breakfast also was good though so I'd, I'd sit in the middle of those two and, and do you know what just being back at animal kingdom was amazing as well so i know that's three highlights a day so it doesn't really it's not fair but today was just nice it, hey <laughs> chill out mate <laughs> food sana yeah sana was good food was good bread service was really good um mains were nice kids meals were a bit dry weren't they yeah um page of really. cheeseburger it didn't look very appetizing callum's um mac and cheese and um, you had the butter chicken which we had that's yeah. if you're going to get something on the menu the two things I'd recommend is the butter chicken and the bread bo bread service sorry overall it was a nice meal though I'd say give it an 8 8 8.5 8. out of 10 for me what about you sir I'm going to give it a 9 because I really loved it thank you for yeah. watching guys it's really honestly much appreciated the fact that um, people like and watch our vlogs and we've made so many new friends from the vlogs alone and our Instagram Bailey's Do Disney um, if you don't already follow us please do um yeah thank you guys it's been it's been a good day again and it's much appreciated that you're you're along for the ride i guess um thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next vlog which is hollywood studios where are we going for breakfast ohana's ohana ohana we have got ohana's for breakfast in the morning like and subscribe like and subscribe and hit that bell notification because apparently that does something too bye, bye.